Chhat Puja is an Indian festival which is celebrated for Chhatti Maya and sun god Surya. Chhat Puja dates in the year 2023 or Friday 17th to Monday 20th of November. Chhat is mostly observed in the states of Bihar, Jharkhand and eastern Uttar Pradesh and also in some other parts of India. Lord Surya is said to ride a chariot drawn with seven horses. Also known as Surya Shashti, the Chhat Puja is a bathing festival. During the four days of the festival, Lord Sun, the god of energy and life force, is worshipped. The uniqueness of Chhat Puja is both the rising sun and also the setting sun are worshipped. Chhati Maya is the solar goddess. Chhati Maya Puja is uh, performed on the sixth day of the lunar month called Kartik as per Hindu calendar. The last and main day of the Chhat festival is observed on the Kartik Shukla Shasti Tithi as per lunar calendar. People celebrate Chhat Puja to thank the sun god who is the life giver to the whole earth. The sun is the primary source of energy for our planet. Chhat Puja is a way to express gratitude towards Surya Bhagwan. All the things used in the Chhat festival are organic and biodegradable. They cause no harm to our environment. Prasad is made with grains and vegetables and offered in earthen pots and mud lamps are lit. The rituals of Chhat Puja are performed on the banks of rivers and water bodies. Devotees clean the gods of the lakes ponds and rivers. This makes us realize the importance of water without which life is not possible. Chhat Puja tells us to conserve water. However, the pressures of modern life sometimes make it difficult to take care of the environment during the festivities. More about this at the end of the video. Chhat Puja also teaches us the importance of living in harmony with nature. The sun god and Chhatti Maya both are the deities of nature and are mainly worshipped in the Chhat festivities. Teaches us to connect with nature and encourages people to live closer to nature. Water, trees, leaves, fruits, flowers, vegetables, grains, bamboo, the list is endless with various aspects of nature. Day 1 Nahai Khai On the first day of Chhat Puja, devotees take a bath in a river, pond or other water bodies. During this day, devotees clean their houses and eat only sattvic food. Day 2 Kharna On the second day of Chhat Puja, devotees observe a day-long Nirjala fast, which is broken in the late evening after performing the worship of Mother Earth. The prasad is made up of rice, jaggery, pure ghee and bottle guard kaddu, curry with puri, all organic ingredients. In the night, they prepare thekua, a deep-fried traditional sweet made from wheat flour and jaggery. Thekwa is also called khajur, usually design of a leaf or some flower in put on the thekwa. Day 3 Sandhya Argha Devotees offer evening prayer to sun god. They gather at river or pond and stand in water while offering prayers to sun god. People do fasting for 24 hours or 36 hours. Day 4 
Usha Argha. It is the fourth day or the final day of Chhat Puja. Usha Argha means the ritual of offering water to the rising sun. Chhat festival causes huge negative impact on the water bodies and the environment. Materials like oil, flowers, fruit, coconut, incense sticks, various plastic items are disposed of directly into the rivers and this adds to the severe water quality depletion in the water bodies that are already polluted very badly. Strong belief system and faith pushes people to perform rituals even in dangerous situations like this. Celebrating Chhat in artificially made ponds. In an effort to save the water bodies, using artificial ponds is encouraged for the festivities. This is also good for the devotees, not just for the environment. To control and prevent the pollution caused by various festivities, there are many acts and rules already in place. But without our active participation, that is participation by the people, nothing of this is going to work out. Let us all come together to celebrate an eco-friendly chat festival.